plant water relations water is required by plants in almost all of their physiological activities water also act as a medium of solubilization for various organic nutrients etc and water also constitutes a major part of the plant as in case of watermelon water potential as you know water molecules they possess kinetic energy more the kinetic energy of water more is the water potential it is denoted by a greek symbol psi and a small w below it solute potential and pressure potential whenever we will add or we will dissolve any solute in water now the free moving water molecules will reduce hence the kinetic energy will reduce hence the water potential will reduce and this is known as solute potential pressure potential whenever water moves inside a cell it becomes target it exhibits pressure across its cell wall and membrane and this is known as pressure potential water potential is summation of solute potential and pressure potential and is denoted by a equation in which psi w is equal to psi s plus psi p osmosis osmosis is the diffusion of water across or through a semi permeable membrane rate of this diffusion or rate of osmosis is usually dependent on pressure and concentration gradient in this water moves from a higher concentration to a lower concentration you can see in the diagram the movement of water there is a semi permeable membrane present and water is moving from a higher concentration towards a lower concentration plasmolysis plasmolysis is that process in which if a cell is placed in hypertonic solution hypertonic solution is the solution which is having excessive solute concentration in comparison to the solute concentration of that cell then the water will move out of the cell and cell will shrink this will the water will move out because there is high water potential inside the cell and low water potential outside so water will flow from high to lower region and hence cell will shrink and plasmolysis will occur similarly water is moving inside cell will become flaccid 